I don't think there's much similarity in the, the way we bring them up. But I think that gives them an incredible perspective to then choose which pieces of those two lives they'd like to inherit and move on with. Gavin explains to Not So Hollywood podcast host Adriana Costa that he and ex-Gwen aren't always on the same page when it comes to parenting their three boys. We definitely have some particularly opposing views, so I think they would be really helpful for them to make their own minds as they should as individuals. Blake Shelton, who is now stepfather to Gwen's boys, told us earlier this year how he fits into the mix. They have a mom and a dad, and they, now they have a, a Blake. I want to be a positive influence. That's the kind of parent that, that I want to be. Gwyneth Paltrow answered a fan question on Instagram about whether Apple ever wears her old looks, sharing this photo of her daughter in her 2002 Alexandra McQueen Oscar gown. Girls. Beyonce had some fun during her Renaissance World Tour stop in Germany when a fan asked her to do her gender reveal. The exciting news left the crowd cheering. More concert news as David Beckham and daughter Harper sang along word for word to Harry Styles at his Love On Tour concert in England. The video ending with an adorable father-daughter kiss. And Lizzo made seven-year-old Aria Cannon's dream come true, pulling her up on stage in Connecticut earlier this week for a big hug. Aria telling Access she had the time of her life. She said she loved me and I was special and nothing can stop me. Aria's journey began last year. Her mom, Danielle, shared an adorable video of her dancing along to Lizzo's It's About Damn Time. The video went viral and got the attention of Lizzo, the pair winning tickets to the concert, and the rest is history.